Hi guys, welcome back to HAG Studios. Today I'm standing beside a noni plant and that will give you an idea of what we're going to be talking about. In Jamaica, there are so many plants and herbs that grow natural that are good for us. We're going to be talking with someone who knows about these. Desi Natural, holistic herbal doctor. So, come with us. Hi. <laughs> How you doing, man? Nice to meet you, man. I hear yes, all sorts of things about you, you know. The same thing me I hear about your <laughs> program. I love it. I <laughs> oh, natural thing. We thank are you. Home garden. Health, home, and gardening. You're part of the health. I you know the health and the wealth. Oh, yeah. The I health really? is the wealth. That's right. We have you to start with that with first. Without that, yeah, know? no matter how we garden, pretty and we home, pretty if we don't have the health. Every other is thing I go mess. Yes, I go mess up. Yeah, but make me start with the noni. Since I already, I mean, this is growing quite a bit. You have this growing up at the front of the house. Yeah. Mm. So tell me, what are the benefits of the noni? All right, show homage to all of the bush doctor them who paved the way uh -huh. before I and I, from Imhotep to Granny Nani. Uh -huh. the great Peter Touch, original bush doctor. Uh -huh. All right, you know, send me up on the journey, life journey. These uh -huh. noni plants, I don't plant them, you know. Uh -huh. But noni, if you ever know about noni in Jamaica, uh -huh. I will discover this plant, noni in Jamaica, they are green now. Yes. I soon show you a ripe one way how to reap them. Yes, So yes. them filling up, you see the blossom. So when it There's a lot now, of them you're going you on know, this so, man. So this is when it's right. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the noni plant when mm -hmm. it's right. So when we it, like the little calabash right, dish. Yeah, man. It's <laughs> everything natural, you know? Yes. Mm -hmm. So the noni now, I use the noni to do a lot of things. I mix it with the sea mass. Mm -hmm. You know, the marble or something. I put it in my water and drink it, too, you know? Mm -hmm. I put it in our roots. This plant now, I, I, I hear that I look at you of asthma mm -hmm. in Portland. Mm -hmm. And I'm just curious and think it's a fruit. And just take it and start eating it. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. And I start eating it now, I vomit out. i big yellow something. Uh -huh. Asthma disappears. Really? No more asthma problem. Uh -huh. So this plant, known, it goes to the two blood cells. Red and white blood cells. Powerful mm -hmm. plant. And mm -hmm. I mean plant them here. Yeah. I mean ancestor plant them. Okay. So I try to cut it down, them say there's a make sure you put it in your medicine. So yeah. it's right. good for um, asthma and anything else? So much something. Okay. Like you what know? else? Diabetic, you know, mm -hmm. a popular product me and you know, I don't know if they put it for anything, but if mm -hmm. you know taste bud. Mm -hmm. You know the noni. Noni is in it. Noni is the only plant that goes to the red cell and the white cell. There is no other plant on earth that goes to the two cells then. Mm -hmm. So it's so powerful, you know. Okay. You know how many times I get this and I put it in bottle and it's supposed to drain, drain. right? Yeah. But boy, when it don't drain, me can't drink it, you know. All right. <laughs> me don't like how it is. But all right. Sure <laughs> so you mix it with other things? With other stuff. Mm -hmm. And I can take it the same way with a teaspoon. Mm -hmm. But when I was about 10 years old, mm -hmm. I take a trip to Clarendon, my birthplace. Mm -hmm. And I see this plant talking to me. And I mm. said, what a plant the name? And the brother said, Duppy Sawasap. Yes, I And I said, Duppy Sawasap, how is that good for? The man said, what do you for things? So I mm -hmm. said, how you deal with it? So you know the ripe one the smell a smell away. Like when it mm -hmm. starts drinking, mm -hmm. it, it brings a, a smell where we're not used to. Mm -hmm. You know, I'm not gonna say it's thinking. You know. It brings mm -hmm. a smell where we're not used to. You have to adjust to adjust it. Adjust it. Mm -hmm. See, in our house, so we get taken from it. So we yes. get reminded to it. And when the noon you touch your system, man, remember me tell you. I mix up the noon with the roots and call it overdrive. I'll be a man and thank me. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> yes, sir. You know, Desa, I was surprised that you told me that this is medicinal. I usually pull these out of my garden and throw them away. So what's that? What All are right. They? You know them call it one stone crusher? I never know that. And you know why I know why them call it. Why them call it stone crusher? You know, we have kidney stone. Mm -hmm. So this remove kidney stone with other herbs. Mm -hmm. You know, it so look like tambourine leaf. Yes. Yes. yes so it's named true. stone crusher. Oh, is that named stone crusher? Yeah, for the kidney. 
So what you do this, with it? You this, would have to boil it or? You have to boil it with other herbs. Like this is one of the kidney thing good for one of the combination, the one of the milk wheat. Oh. Yeah? You see, you have a little buds like the weed mm. with them fight against. Mm. Watch you know. You see this now? Oh yeah, there's a... Now white something here. Mm, yes, sir. You put it on mm. the wart and it helps to remove wart. Okay. Yeah, good for eating your cut too. And okay. the plant itself, good for cleaning your blood. It's a natural blood purifier. It means milkweed. Yeah. But I have to go sing twice about hey, pulling them out. this one? Mama, sorry for break your feet, you know. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So when you're reaping medicine, you talk to the plant and ask for the medicinal properties in it, yeah? Uh -huh. So this one named Ram Goat Dashala. <laughs> for diabetic and many other complaints, yeah? Mm -hmm. Alright, for the man them, you want to do the work homework proper. You want to name Medina. Mm -hmm. Good for the back, stamina is up. I know yeah? Medina. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. Yeah, man. And that and normally goes quite full out on the ground. It the earth spreads. is a lot in the fullness mm -hmm. there. We don't plant herbs. herbs so what is ram, ram go dash along? Me like the name. What that good for? As you say, good for diabetic. Oh, diabetic. So I how, mean, how would a diabetic person use that? Them drink it as tea. Okay. Yeah? So, like so you kind of steep now, it? Yes, you, you dry it. Mm -hmm. You add mm -hmm. the water, put it in the like, put three leaf to a cup of water, put it for set. Put it for set for, set for like a few minutes. 10, 15, 15 minutes. minutes. Drink it straight. Mm -hmm. If you can't drink it straight, you drink like a honey, you know? Yes, you add yeah. a little honey. Uh -huh. Okay. All of these weeds, but I didn't, and I know all the names, but I never connected the names with the weed. Yeah. But I've seen all of these. As a gardener, right. you see all these things going. This are the doppy gun shot. Mm -hmm. No, you don't have to pull it No Enough people, I try to jump the road because enough people get tricked and say I drink sin. You see them drink sin road? That's how powerful it is. Oh, ginseng? Yeah. Okay. The Jamaican one. Okay. So this are the part where it pop. Oh. You put it nice on it, just pop like a gun shot. Oh. So they call it doppy gun shot. <laughs> you know? Stamina is a man make sure you drink up this. Mm -hmm. See, you know, put in on the roads and thing, you know, with the Medina. Yeah, them call that one a magic plant. Mm -hmm. Otherwise called Moringa. This have so much vitamins, mineral, everything. More calcium than milk. Mm -hmm. Six times the amount of spinach, six times the amount of iron down with spinach up, mm -hmm. all or something. So alright, watch you now. Me you like mm -hmm. iron. Look how me I pick iron tablet. Yeah. Iron tablet. This iron me tablet. I pick off a tree, you know. Yeah. See? I'm gonna shell it if you want to clean out it, just mm -hmm. eat it straight. How much of these you can take? Because I three three to six for the day. Oh, because it huh? depends on the person though, because I hear people say they take a few and it kind of make them a little... Yeah, I'm only sipping. And when eh? you drink the water, if you don't love water, <laughs> water nice, mm -hmm. sweet and sour. Mm -hmm. Tastes good. You this feel one it? actually tastes like peanut. Yeah, you get that sweet mm -hmm. and sour vibes there. Eh? Yeah. You feel it, I go through your system mm -hmm. right away. Mm -hmm. Life, you know. Nice. Magic plant, you know, moringa. Moringa. So what I do you know, I personally powder the leaf mm -hmm. and sell it, mm -hmm. so you can sprinkle it in your food. Mm -hmm. You can even pick it and make green juice, like mm -hmm. get your jelly water and blend it up with any other else something and get the medicinal value of it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. This plant, I love your moringa. Powerful <laughs> plant, you know. I have the moringa roots. You know, me have this tree. And I'm, sh I'm ashamed to tell you, I hardly use it. This is I use every day. I use it every day. Every day. I Mir promise you, I agree. Miracle start. plant, you know? Yeah, that's why I got it. Remember because I, I heard it was Remember a... I say health is your wealth. My then. health is my wealth. So and don't I'm promise going me. To, yeah, to care promise your myself. Health. Eh? You know, health is what? <laughs> your responsibility. That's right. I'm so <laughs> afraid of it as I could take a walk over the name tree. <laughs> This is the famous neem tree. 
This also has a lot of uh, medicinal value. Eh? So much of them. You get up and you don't have a toothpaste. Mm -hmm. Just pick him. Oh. I use them clean the teeth. Really? Yeah. Oh. I and we have the oil. Mm -hmm. To hide the skin to mm -hmm. avoid insect bite and mm -hmm. the ear and all of that, you know? Yeah, yeah. And these fruits, the leaf bitter, but them when they're ripe, them sweet. Oh, okay. Come like Cersei. This is not ripe right now? No, this green. Oh, no bother mm -hmm. with me on it then. Yeah. <laughs> How you extract the oil out of this? Alright, the oil now, mm -hmm. we cold press it, we infuse it with coconut mm -hmm. to extract it. Mm -hmm. When I boil it, you have ones that boil the leaf on the seed. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. You have ones that boil So is the seeds that you use or is these seeds? Yeah, along with the leaf. Along but, with the leaf. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, But my one mostly have in the leaf because it's cold press, uh -huh. infused. Yeah? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Yes, sir. Yeah. Okay. Medicinal value, excellent for cleaning teeth. Mm -hmm. it, 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 it fight against bacteria overall. Mm -hmm. Naturally, if you have fly even or mess around and you pick two leaves and you put it, them just stay away. Okay. You see me, that's how powerful this plant mm -hmm. is. If you check the Indian them, uh, it's like a them number one plant. Okay. Them combine the neem with the turmeric and it do marvelous stuff for you. If okay. you ever take that nine morning, remember me tell you. You can use this as a tea as well? As a tea, you know, okay. for clean the system. And it, not, it look you know? pretty, you could actually put it in a vase. Yes, yeah. we just had to talk about the neem. Mm -hmm. Now people don't like neem because it's bitter. Mm -hmm. But remember, it's so bitter to the mouth, sweet to the belly. Mm -hmm. Ministry of Health tells us that the sugar is killing a mm -hmm. diabetic patient. Mm -hmm. Tough fire, bring the aloe vera come then. Alright. Alright, you see that plant here? Yeah? fire. Right. <laughs> that plant here called aloe vera. <laughs> the Rasta man call it Cinco Bible. Mm -hmm. You know how I first. I know just Bible. Rasta man call it Jamaicans call it Cinco Bible. Cinco Bible. <laughs> yes. You see? Yes. So watch, you know. We just had to have a bit of the mouth, sweet to the belly, you know? You know, this has so much medicinal property. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It's good for the skin. That one I know. It's good for the hair. Mm -hmm. It's good for all the inside, so much thing. Uh -huh. You know? You sip it them right there, we lift uh -huh. the lip when I just start the lip. Talk a bit more yeah, about this one. though. Apart from, I know it's good for the skin. And what it does, because you just ate some, so. All right. Mm -hmm. You see the bleach of them? Mm-hmm. We don't do them thing. No, they don't need to bleach. <laughs> Who don't need to bleach? Uh -uh. Don't buy them bleaching cream. See it? Natural aloe vera. Keep your skin pretty and nice. For the tourists that come to Jamaica, and you don't take on a suntan, rub this pan on your skin. So if nice. I want to take out two little blockheads and sit. Uh -huh. You can use that. The marvelous thing for you. You uh -huh. know, people, you know? Yes, rub sir. me and rub it in. Half yeah. an hour time, I wash it off her face. Uh -huh. Her face nice and yeah. pretty. That one I use I watch a lot. Going now. I don't spend a dollar for it. All right, so we're on to sour sap. Uh, this is one of my favorite drinks. Sour, sour sap. sap. Well, I, I like don't it. use it. Well, I, I just love the, the, the taste. I love the taste of sour sap. Do you know what it's good for? I know it's good for me, but I'm not sure exactly what. And I know you can make. I've used the leaves for tea, but I haven't been consistent with it. All right. We have something. Mm -hmm. We are a mash up in Jamaica. Mm -hmm. When you are war with the one that we name yeah. cancer. Mm -hmm. You see me? So mm -hmm. you see sour sap, great for the cancer. Yeah. And you see shaking, nervous pro nerves problem. Mm -hmm. the sour I know it's sap, good for your nerves taste, too. You know? mm -hmm. So the difference with them now, oh you reap sour sap. They are young sour sap. They mm -hmm. are young. You see mm -hmm. that one over there sir? Mm -hmm. That's a fit sour sap. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. that could pick and put up. 
Too right. If you don't want to burn them first, yeah. Yes. Because you don't know the bird them <laughs> up know first, the birds. Yeah, you know? yeah, man. You have to but, compete with the birds. But it's a marvelous plant. The yeah. leaf, even the bark. The bark uh -huh. more powerful than the leaf. Mm -hmm. You don't say if I make a nerve stonic, I use the bark instead of the leaf. Mm -hmm. It's a powerful plant, man. So, so you I just think. boil it down, I think. They, they, you they, put they, the leaves they, they, they dry the it. If you make some tea, you're mm -hmm. making some tea. You put like tree leaf in it and dry it. And just dry it. But it's good for you to make it quail. Oh. You know, say what, why do they, they always say make it quail? All you right, know when why? it's green, it's more stronger. Oh. So if you use a green leaf, you have to use less. Less. You know, dry okay. leaf, you have to request more, you know? Oh. Okay, so tell me what this one is now. This is cheney root. No. Cheney root come from under the earth. This grow up. Oh, okay. Plant. Oh, okay. And it's it not tobacco this... either. <laughs> you know? It look like tobacco. You know? It kind of fuzzy leaf. Eh? Fuzzy leaf. Smell yes. it. Yes. Oh, Smell okay. nice, eh? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You see the people and we have So what is name problem. now? You see people and we have heart problem mm -hmm. when they get this and drink up. The name search my heart. So mm -hmm. that means you have search go to your heart mm -hmm. and give the heart tonic. Mm -hmm. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Search my heart. Mm -hmm. Yeah, man. Look it up. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, oh. yeah you see this one? Yeah? It looks like one piece of stick down. I'm mm -hmm. just burn it up. Mm -hmm. Yeah? This name Bitterwood. Bitterwood. Mm -hmm. Imhotep, the father of medicine, I used it as a to heal people a long time. Mm -hmm. You see me I say, bitterhood, good for deworm your system, it's good for your blood, mm -hmm. there's so much something for your system. I design natural put this in a medita. Just a mm -hmm. little piece of it and you put it on your tongue and it's so bitter. Mm -hmm. Bitterhood, bitterhood. <laughs> Alright, for the man them know, the, all right, the one I know, look for it. Mm -hmm. Look like a piece of piece of whisk. Piece of twist. Whisk. Mm -hmm. Twist. Whisk. Mm -hmm. You see this? Mm -hmm. This name Saucy Perla. Oh. So you hear them say you have a saucy? Mm -hmm. And the saucy pearl are this. Okay, so this grows as what? As a vine? It grows like or a this? yam grow. Under oh. the earth and it brings up and a yam vine. This. The yam right, vine. The yam right. vine. So we have to dig it out like how we dig out yam from under the ground. And but so this part would be up the top. No, under this the This underground this, too? This is like the yam. Okay, okay. So you carry the same vine with the yam carry with mm. that juki juki. So it have there. something like yam under the ground? No, this, this is the plant. Everything is under the ground? This is the plant. Wow. Underneath. So this mm. would be the yam then for just, mm -hmm. you know? Where so you know, name again? Saucy Perla. Saucy Perla. Maybe. So you know, so if you get to the yam, you have to dig out the earth. Yes, yes. So we see it run up. Stark like the yam, uh -huh. and it ripe like how when you see yam. So it have leaves or it's just a twist? Yeah, that's what I'm saying to you. So mm -hmm. It carry a stalk like yam. You have knowledge about mm -hmm. yam or yam grow. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yam carry something come up on it. Mm -hmm. And when it's yellow, you know the yam ready for dig. Right. So same thing with this, it carry a similar thing like uh -huh. the yam with the juki juki maca on the leaf. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So when the leaf get yellow, mm -hmm. you know a saucy pearl are ready for reap. Oh, okay. So we have to dig it out like how we go to the yam and mm -hmm. buck him up so, and reap him. Mm -hmm. So we take him from under the earth with a whole heap of dirt and just mm -hmm. run. Yeah? Mm -hmm. This is the number one blood purifier. Mm -hmm. Sarsi Perla. It's mm -hmm. also a tonic. Mm -hmm. And it's also give you iron. So it's our next iron source. Medicine this. Mm -hmm. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. I have the one named Chain Root. I chop it up now. Mm -hmm. But it comes like a chain. You know, a chain with a mm -hmm. link and a link. And this comes mm -hmm. like this is a yam too. Mm -hmm. They call this wild yam. Mm -hmm. So it grows just so like the like yam. This is like a yam. This is not bark. It's oh, it's a so bark. Tough. It grows just like the yam. Mm -hmm. And then it gets dry. Say, and it, it, yeah, so if mm -hmm. you get him young, before him get tough, you can eat him like yam. Oh. So this gives you iron. This is a this mineral. This so this go under street. the ground too? Just like how I described with the yam, mm -hmm. same thing. Mm -hmm. 
Yes, sir. I find things that grow under the ground are usually rich in iron and, mineral. and minerals. Yes, yes sir. Mm. You know, so mm. it grows just like how wood and dig yam. Mm -hmm. So we can't just go pick it up. Mm -hmm. You have to go with your hoe and your mash it and dig up and mm -hmm. take him out, dig him out of the earth, <laughs> you know, and cut him off. Uh -huh. So they have one named Allman Strength, you know it? No, I don't know that one. What you say, Neil? Allman Strength, or All some call it strength. Three Man Strength. Three Man Strength. Yeah? It's okay. alright. I guess this is the Three Man. Oh, yes. yes. You know? <laughs> the three sides. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. So this gives you energizer, mm -hmm. stamina, so we we'll put mm -hmm. this in our roots. Mm -hmm. yeah, especially for the men, eh? Especially for the man. And for mm. the woman, them too. We yes. are complaining about the back and all of that. <laughs> and gas pain and them things. Mm -hmm. You see me? Okay. All man's strength, you know? Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. So, how you prepare this all man's strength or three right. man's strength? It's all man's strength. You mm -hmm. see this now? This is the, the, the train you will chop up. Mm -hmm. So, I'm going to chop up this fine and forget mm -hmm. the medicinal property. Mm -hmm. Along with this, along with the Medina, mm -hmm. along with the Duppy Gun, mm -hmm. along with the Ramoon and a couple of other things. But you sound overpowerful there, man. So, when mm -hmm. I created it, Mm -hmm. The hyper roots. Hyper. Which is the right type of roots. Mm -hmm. You know, I mean, I look a bird pepper in this too. Mm -hmm. But how me? much of this you can drink? The, this you whole bottle drink? at once? Yeah, man, or more. No alcohol, no mm -hmm. chemical, no fertilizer. Don't even put pipe water in my stuff. You put Straight coconut, spring water. Spring water. You know? Mm -hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. we have to keep it clean and pure. Mm -hmm. The herbs them have to dig within a certain time within the moon to yes. get that medicinal value out of it. Right, that's you when know? the moon is growing or Yes, or three day before the moon full or three day before the after the moon full. Oh, okay. So we have okay. six days out of the month for real reap herbs. Right. To get that real medicinal property there. Okay. Out of it, you know? Okay. So yeah. is it would that apply for all of the others you showed us? Like if I'm gonna pick the others out there. You can make some tea, you know. You can mm -hmm. use it as a tea and get the medicinal property out of it. But it would be best to reap those two, um, three days before the full moon and three days after. If you want no the matter. real medicinal value out of it. The full medicinal value. The full value. medicinal. But if okay. you reap it within the time, you will still get medicinal value. Mm -hmm. But not as the full potential. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah. That's good to know. You know? Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. So tell me now about some of the medicinal plants that are good for some of the common illnesses say for example fi fibroids which All is right. very common among black women you as a black woman come check i design natural as a holistic doctor mm -hmm. may approach it holistically way mm -hmm. So first of all, I'm going to ask you what the size, because you must know the size for no mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You know, so it depends on the size. Mm -hmm. I make medicine for that. Okay. But the first thing I'm going to give you is design natural detox. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. So the detox have in the same training route, the saucy pearl, the same bitter wood, you know, rice bitters, spring water, mm -hmm. you know, them things there. So that, that the marvelous something for your system is like it mm -hmm. service your system. Mm -hmm. So probably you take that, because people take it and say the fiber will drop out in a tidy. Really? Say the marvelous thing. People couldn't walk and it, people say make them walk again. Mm -hmm. Because we put the stuff them great for the human structure. I'm mean, not talking about just black people. I'm mean, talking mm -hmm. about white people, people Chinese all over. people. Yes. All the dog it work on. <laughs> See him? Mm -hmm. That get poison and me give him mm -hmm. bitters and him hope and run oh. again. Mm -hmm. So always remember, so what bitter to the mouth, sweet to the belly. Yeah. When you have five birds and you eat chicken and certain things, you have to feed it. Mm -hmm. So you have to eliminate it. You know, so you drink up the sea mass, so I design natural, mm -hmm. provide sea mass, sea mass, clean mucus from all over the system. Mm -hmm. And it's one sickness, and it's mucus. But mm. which part of the mucus is? The period cramp. See it? Uh? The good old name. Mm -hmm. Good for it. Make some tea. So all of the mama them test it and tell me what I want. Ah. They have a next one in the name. Color mint. I don't know if you know that mint there. Yeah, man. Great I have feet. it, actually. Yeah? Mm. They have a next one in the name. Dog blood. You know that one there? Eh? Dark blood great feet. And you have penny royal great feet. And, and you just so make much. tea and just drink it. Just make tea and drink it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, 
common illnesses, high blood pressure, diabetes, very common. How oh, you get high blood pressure? Mm -hmm. First thing that I ever ask I want, come check me. How oh, you get high blood pressure? You see? Mm -hmm. Them don't know. Uh -huh. You're eating a lot of salt. Yeah. You see? And, you, and your, your mental, how you think, yeah. your thought process, uh -huh. can run up your pressure. So pretty more positive me people. Mm -hmm. You know? When you know I go through a pressure, you know, say pressure bus pipe, say you cool down the pressure by doing this. Mm-hmm. No, I didn't. So if someone if what someone chip you out and you plan for fight, the 10 seconds and come. Mm-hmm. That 10 seconds they are gonna make you think, say yo, no right for me. Yeah. You're not gonna make them job them to feed them level. That's right. You know? So you just laugh. That's a one great medicine. Oh laughter. yeah. Laughter. <laughs> yeah? Speak good about yourself. You know? So you go in the mirror, you go in the mirror and you talk good about yourself. So I'm in love with you. You're talking to yourself. <laughs> You're afraid of yourself. <laughs> you know? Take off it, your clothes just like all the father, your father and your mother bring you forward. <laughs> so you know anything about no material thing when you check yourself. I'm in love with myself. I'm proud of myself. Don't cuss the big belly where you have. Because mm -hmm. you put it on, you never born with it. Mm -hmm. So, what you have to do for bust off the belly? You see? So, we have to make measures. So, like the high blood pressure and them say diabetes, that means you don't produce enough insulin. Mm -hmm. So, you have mess with the system. So, you have to cut off the starch and the blood. Blood and starch is not our food. Mm -hmm. And you see, we are sunburned people. We come from the continent where they call Africa was mm -hmm. before named Kush. So if you go back to Genesis, and Genesis means the beginning. You see, you know, in Genesis, so you must eat from the earth. The food and your medicine must come from the earth, which is the plant. And this is a turmeric, which can, it grows easily. You can actually, you can actually plant it with, in your flower beds. You can just break off this mm -hmm. and even throw it in some dirt. Mm -hmm. and just water and it, it. Right, and it will grow. See? Uh -huh. And turmeric has so much health benefit. Mm -hmm. Yeah, good for cancer. A good, nice skin vibration too. Mm -hmm. Good for so much things. See, I develop a product out there. Right? Uh -huh. One of them is stimulant, you know? Uh -huh. the marvelous stuff, yeah? But this there, people are using this a lot for um, COVID. Treatment. This knock him away. Hey, this Locally knock and internationally. Yes. And them mm. say it and I mean, I don't catch So this have been turmeric and... Turmeric, it have been ginger, it have been bird mm. pepper, it have been cayenne pepper, it have mm -hmm. been honey, it have been civil orange, it have been lime. Okay. 100%. Good taste? No water. Well, it have a little pepper revives. Oh, okay. okay. That's the only thing mm -hmm. they say, well, you know, but it's great for mm -hmm. me, you know, others, you know. Yes, you sir. Know, so, so, if you get a natural turmeric mm -hmm. and yellow up your yacht, good for the eye, you know? Yeah. Yacht I... what we call pot, yeah? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> and I know that when you plant this in your garden, because I just plant this among my flowers. Yeah. And then when it starts to dry is when you should reap. It means yeah, the leaves ready. dry up. The leaves, the dry leaves up. start to dry up. Similar when I tell about the, the saucy pearl or anything, uh -huh. the leaves dry up. Yes. Yes. And if you don't repeat it, I will just go back to the earth like and a cycle start and start again. again. Yes, yes. You know? Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, yeah mm -hmm. man. So a ginger farm belly, it's a ginger look alike mm -hmm. in our plants. And mm -hmm. him don't need no holy for attention. No, you just plant it and him have a price one. for him. Simple as you see him there. Uh -huh. You know, so farmers, all of the gardener, garden ladies them. Plant on the turmeric and stop going to the market for another land. You don't yeah, know yeah. what to do. You can plant it in a pot. All in your pot. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, so the good old coconut tea. Don't have them food make your belly swelly. Eh? I said, don't have them food make your belly swelly. I rather. I rather drink some jelly, hey, hey. some nice water jelly, you know. Hey, hey. Because I know you know I make the belly swell, you know. Right, yeah. right. So, um, coconut water. And I know you tell me it's not coconut milk. Why is not coconut milk again? 
No milk here, breast. <laughs> or breast mm -hmm. care milk. And coconut, yeah. no, coconut no have no breast, so it can't be milk. Can't All be right, milk. so what you call it? Thank you. All right, you know, we Asian, them would call it dreadnought. Mm -hmm. You see, so them say dreadnought juice. Oh, it's a juice. It's yeah, a you juice. know? Yeah. And then the other part is this is the water now. So this is the part where them call the milk. Because it look white like milk. Yes, but yes. No that's milk. Why. Mm -hmm. You know? <laughs> no milk there. there. <laughs> so we just extract this uh -huh. and it looks creamy. Mm -hmm. And I use it like a natural ice cream, non dairy. Better no fruits, the fruits, the right banana, really? the coconut, like an ice berry, cream, the jackfruit, uh -huh. like a thick smoothie. When you use this oh, as the cream, mm -hmm. and then you freeze it up, and you have that natural ice good. cream. That so good. So you can give you them, them, then it tastes nice and sweet. Natural sugar. This uh -huh. have sugar. The jackfruit have sugar. Mm -hmm. The banana have sugar. All of that. And if you don't want it sweeter, use the dates or the natural raisin. Okay. Yeah. okay. Yeah. And if you're making juice and you don't want to use no sugar, you throw this in the blender and you blend it up with anything. Mm -hmm. and your juice tastes nice. And the coconut, them always say it rinse your heart. Wash off your heart. Wash off your heart. You know? <laughs> yes, sir. Yeah, man. Yeah. And so. lower the pressure too. Uh huh. You know, balance the amount of thing when you know the coconut mm -hmm. itself. Mm -hmm. See, if you can even drink one jelly a day, marvelous. Mm -hmm. A jelly tree takes five years to bear. Look at that. And every drip of the water filtered. The cleanest water on earth. Yeah. The water that grow the water that come from up in the sky. You know, oh water water got oh, jelly belly. Oh so much belly. water. Oh water mm -hmm. water got jelly belly. Mm -hmm. Only left for the comments and tell them oh water water got jelly belly. <laughs> jelly belly. <Is> it? <laughs> <laughs> well, it has been a pleasure. Give thanks. Yes, thank you, you know? so much. I learned so much. Yes, sir. And I've always been interested in these things, but I'll be more interested now. Yes, sir. <laughs> Knowledge is power. Knowledge is the power. Earth is the Lord and the fullness thereof. Yes. Yeah? So eat more natural, drink more natural, live more natural. Design natural, health is a wealth. Health, home and garden. My light is what you put in front. Health. health. Without no health, health, you can't have no home. And you can't take care of your garden. Mm -hmm. So always remember your health is your wealth. Yes. Design natural represented.